Hello, everybody out there. How are you doing? Welcome back to the channel. I'm going to be recording for Virgo. Let's go into Virgo, okay? Um, for those of you that are interested in spiritual candles, sage, I have that on my website. Plus, you'll find over 100 products on the website. All my information is down below, you guys. Um, let's get into it. Let's see what's happening with you. What can you expect for the next week? Let's see. You can watch this for any Virgo placements. All right. Okay, someone's getting justice out here. This is great, okay? As an overall energy. He was so up today. All right, here you are at a crossroad, Virgo. You may not know what to do in life right now, but, you know, there's many things that you can get out there and do. Here you are waiting. Okay, what are you waiting on? Communication, travel, work. A person. We got fire energy in. We got fire energy here twice. Leo Sag Aries energy. Oh yeah, we got transformation here. We got Scorpio energy. Some of y'all might know a Scorpio. But something new is happening here, okay? With the death card. Someone may be budgeting their money around this time or you're holding on to something. Some of you could be Holding on to a relationship that's falling apart. Okay, some of y'all could be dealing with a Gemini. Somebody could be headed towards divorce, breakup, separation, whatever it is. Okay. I see Gemini here twice. Okay. We got the lovers reversed. And we also have the magician. Okay. I see someone having some money problems here. Okay. Some of y'all might not see it yet, but I see money problems, health problems around the situation. All right? With the five of pentacles showing up here. And I also see someone communicating with some water energy here, which I do see Scorpio, like I said. All right? That could be your energy, okay? Or somebody else's. Whoever this water sign is, I feel like this person might have spied on you, lied to you or something, or you did that. You did the same thing to that person, okay? It can go either way. But I don't see you really getting along with water signs right now unless, you know, it's a temporary thing, okay? Let me see. I feel like somebody is, I feel like somebody is a, a liar, okay? Use your intuition about anything connected to water right now, all right? And I see a lot of communication going on, okay? Some of you could be speaking with people with fire placements. Um, it's saying use your intuition about any communication you're having right now with somebody, okay? And I see some energy of somebody leaving the home too, okay? Somebody wants out of something, they want to leave or... Somebody's uncomfortable in their house. All right. It does not look good. Mm -hmm. So something is out of place, especially with fire placing it here. Okay. Again, there could be some type of breakup, marriage gone bad, something. You know, something falling apart here with the four of wands in reverse. There may not be any stability here anymore. Okay. You had the high priestess for a reason. So you need to trust your gut on whatever's going on around you. Okay. Um again, this water energy is not good. So I feel like it could be Pisces for some of you. Okay. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Pisces person. Or there could be some problems around work or somebody not wanting to work. I'm picking up somebody being very lazy around this time, or somebody can't find a job, or somebody is just it could even be that somebody's acting childish around you or somebody's acting petty. I'm seeing a lot of different energy here with um 
with Virgo. Yeah, so let me get into this, okay? Got a couple people texting me right now. That's why you hear a pause. Sorry about that. But I am shuffling the cards again to see what kind of energy is in here. Virgo. All right. Yeah, this is water. This is all about water right now. So we got a king of cups. Somebody might be, you know... Telling you they care about you or they want to be around you, okay? And I keep seeing a lot of communication going on. So let me see what this communication is about. I feel like somebody's going to communicate something that has to do with somebody healing from, from something that hurt them, okay? That could be you doing that or it could be an air sign or a fire sign doing this, okay? I feel like somebody's using, you know, the money they have to work towards their future, pretty much. I feel like somebody's saving their money right now, okay? Or somebody can't get to the money at this point, okay? Like you're waiting on a paycheck or something. But I feel like somebody wants out. I keep hearing, I want out of the situation. Use your intuition about uh, whether you're helping somebody if you're helping somebody or they're helping you, okay? I see something around your situation that involves water again, and it may also be an Aries as well. Somebody is definitely uh, tired of the way things have been going, and they want to communicate something to you, or you're communicating something to them that can be very harsh, okay? Very nasty. We got air energy here in reverse gemini leave aquarium and this water is just following you all over the place as you can see we got the king of cups and the mother of cups here okay cancer pisces scorpio all right like i said it could be your placements or somebody else's but listen with this hangman energy it could be pisces so around this time something is going on connected to your money situation all right and I feel like it could be that you're not getting enough money and you're settling for whatever is going on around you, okay? And again, I feel like, you know, if this is not you with money problems, it's somebody around you, all right? So, Yeah, what's here? I just want to keep shuffling here because I'm seeing some of the same energy. You know, if I keep seeing the same energy in these damn cars, I'm going to switch to my deck. All right, so it keeps talking about healing taking place with this air energy. Gemini Libra Aquarius. Oh my goodness, you can't get rid of the damn water, can you? This water. Either you're showing somebody want to give them your cup or somebody want to give you a cup. All right. And I keep feeling like you want out. I want out of this contract. I want out of something. I don't want to be around people. You know, I hear somebody saying that. And I see somebody blocking somebody, okay? It could be a fire sign, somebody with fire places. And I also feel like you need to work on your finances and career if this is you, okay? Because I see something that's not going right here, all right? This could be somebody that takes things too serious, okay? Could be very stubborn. It could be, you know, in need of something, okay? Um... What is this all about? Because I see heartbreak here right next to it. Somebody could be getting their heart broken, going through separation and tears as well. And somebody's making decisions about either a scorpion, a fire sign. Somebody's getting tired of waiting on somebody. So they're going to make a decision. Okay. But I feel like there's, there's no closure here with you and either a Gemini or your money situation. Okay. Somebody's holding on to their cash too tight or somebody is just holding on to, to someone that's manipulating them. And somebody's unable to choose whether they want to break up or not. Somebody could be dealing with a soulmate. 
in a twin flame, okay? So there could be separation going on from the soulmate and somebody could be dealing with twin flame energy or somebody can't choose between the soulmate or the twin flame energy. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of different shit here. What's going on? Because somebody's in separation with the water. Let's see what's going on. Or that's about to happen. If it hasn't happened yet, it's probably going to end up happening. It could be you separating from a soulmate. Definitely. Some of you have a soulmate that has water in their chart. Or they might even have Virgo like, like yourself. You know, or they could have fire. All right. Somebody's trying to get out of their head about certain things that bother them. Some of y'all could even have a problem with a Libra out there, too. If you're dealing with Libra, I feel like um, that person probably is going through some type of sickness or something, I feel. Or somebody, I'm picking up that somebody feels like they're not going to win a court case around this time, too. Okay? Somebody's afraid. Because I see legal problems around the situation, too. Somebody could know a, a Leo as well. I see Leo energy here, but I don't feel like you're getting along with this Leo. Like, you don't want to deal with this Leo, okay? This Leo could be blaming you for something. And I feel like it may have a lot to do with somebody's, stabil some, somebody's stability. It could have something to do with, with an Earth sign, too. All right? So... Whose reading is this? Whose reading is this? Virgo, sun, moon, rising, Venus, signs. Or any other placement you want to watch this for. Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. This reading is probably about someone's stability, their money, long-term relationships, something like that, all right? Because I see a relationship dying down, okay? It is going to die down with this water. I'm just going to be real with you guys. Look at this Ten of Cups reverse and the Two of Cups reverse. It's over, whatever that was. And I also see somebody that was in a love triangle, okay? Somebody broke their heart and... They're trying to remove themselves from the situation. Somebody could have been getting used here, too, or in an off-balance relationship. Um, and now it seems like in, the, in another part of your life, there may be some money problems. I definitely see that there. And I feel like somebody's mad because something went wrong with a fire sign. I see it. I see it here. Either something went wrong with a fire sign or somebody with water placements here. Whatever conflict you have going on with a Gemini Libra Aquarius, I feel like it's not going to last too long, okay? Because this person is probably going to try to come back and kiss your ass, okay? I'm just going to be real, all right? This person may disappear on you and come back, or there could be some type of apologies going back and forth here between you and water signs or, or air signs, okay? So, let's see what this is about. Let me get my romance angels out here. And see what this is about. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. So don't don't have any doubt around this time. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Okay. We got that one too. Release your ex, okay? It's not time to release your ex yet. There's still some unfinished business here. So that one is in reverse, all right? So your ex is probably still coming around or something. There's some type of connection going on. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Deception, okay? I feel like with this being in reverse, there's no, de there's no deception right now, okay? No deception. You know, somebody might be more open with you around this time, being truthful about whatever they need to say. Okay, somebody could be speaking the truth towards you. You're speaking your truth towards them. And that's all I have for you guys today.